previously on Aftermath. What kind of wave would cause all this? What is it made of? Why is it here? Whatever was in those computer cards that Gloria Douglas gave me, I bet you has something to do with this wave. Sarah's part of this family. Now, I'll be right back. Dad, Brianna, where are you going? You by any chance that adept I've been looking for? Yeah. Well, then, it's all together, brother. We don't got all day. We slouch to Tesla's towering achievement. Juice for a billion bulbs to light the night when mankind breathes his last gas. You always talked with that voice. Well, I don't like to, but uh, people expect it sometimes. Josh? Can't believe you were holed up here the whole time. Well, yeah. I wouldn't say the whole time. Plus, it's a big place, you know. Well, it's nice you got us the gas to get here, so... Well, it won't be much use after today. But you're sure it's today? Oh, no, I'm, I'm positive, and I have uh, proof. I'd like to see that. Me too. Yeah. Ow. Oh, wash your hands. All good, baby. Now, hang on, hang on a minute. I am digging your art installation. I was trying to relate some of the, the, the phenomena with the disasters, paranormal. You're in there. I'm, I'm flattered. Is any of this going to stop the moon rocks from falling? Nah. No. You got to go with no. OK, but why don't we? Uh... Go with what you've got inside, huh? No, sure. Okay. Yeah, but you're, you're not going to like it. <sighs> no, figuring out when the debris would hit wasn't the hard part with my background. Well, which is what? Well, I was an astrophysicist before things took a turn. <laughs> what kind of turn? Can't say. Just know there was a problem, so I headed out to the Mojave to try to figure it out. Uh-huh. You know, next thing I knew, it was 12 years later, and the wife had declared me dead. You know, I, uh, I liked it a lot. So, you know, I stayed, kept writing the physics about what was coming, but uh, no one would publish it. Mm -hmm. So I wound up overnights on the radio. Skinny heard me, and he brought me out here when it all started to blow. Hey, what kind of physics were you writing? Oh, well, the only one that matters. String theory, you know, space and time. Plus, I have the basic skills for telescopic observations. You have a scope here? Yeah, out back. Nothing serious, just enough to watch the solar system go to shit. Anyway, uh, video feeds in here. You said that you could predict when the debris hit? Oh, ninth grade math, man. Now, where it hits, on the other hand, that's the fiesta. You know, given that the world is spinning at, you know, 1,037 miles and all. So it could miss us completely. Well, we got thousands of these things coming at us. You know, maybe tens of thousands. All different sizes. Yeah, but same velocities, which makes it worse, uh -huh. right? Because it's going to hit all over the globe, all at the same time. How close to where we are? Well, the local impact is a six-state radius around this building. Six states is huge. Well, that could be hundreds of miles away. Yeah, no, no, I wish it were. Uh, let me show you something. This here is the feed from my scope. <clears throat> right there. Yeah, you see, that one's gonna land right on top of us. It's a mile across, moving 10 miles a second. That makes a 12-mile crater, 100-mile blast zone. Then there's three more like that, same path to here. Hundreds more aimed at the Earth in general. So, doesn't matter where in the six states, anywhere is close enough to kill us all. How long to impact? Oh, let's see, uh, 10 miles a second, maybe two hours, you know, in a bit. You know, unless your dad and I can figure out a way to stop it, uh, I'd say we all have about two hours left to live. Drink? And I have a plan. Okay, enlighten me, Matt. Okay, she either ran away or she was taken. Either way, she has to be on a road. This is the only road around for miles. So she's been right by here. Or she's hiding, or God knows what else. She's alive. I know. I'm. You know, that's not even a real hair color. Like, she's probably like mousy brown or something. So? So I'm just saying, what else is she hiding? Why don't you like her? You don't like Devin. I, I do now. It's easy now, Matt. I needed it then. Wait, can Matt, Matt? 
Matt, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Huh. Don't be. You're right. <laughs> God, you must be pissed at me. Serious. You still followed me, are you? Yeah, because I love you, you idiot. Do I have to spell out everything for you? No. I just like making you. What are you doing here? I huh. just left you. It's a trade secret. Where are you going? I gotta find my kids. I only have two hours, right? Well, I'll give you a car. And all you gotta do is tell me everything you know about this. How'd you get that? I wasn't gonna keep it. I just want to know where you got it, because the only way to get one of those is to have a profound spiritual experience. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I didn't kill anybody! <laughs> I killed you! I have something for you. Take it. it. Used to be a bullet. Now it's a stone. So I had a spiritual experience, so what? All I got was this stupid stone. Do you know what's a key? A key? Yeah. To the Umphalus. That's a really, that's a good word. Greek word. The Umphalus is the navel of the world, the center of the universe, and that key could open it up. It's the role of the righteous at the end of the world, or, you know, so some people would think. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Um, do I get the keys, or? Sure. Yeah, okay. rides are out back. He's on the driver's side front tire, anyone but the fair lane. You should try the Delphi Cafe. It's a little south of here. Delphi Cafe. You'll never know what you'll find. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. Don't mention it. Now I gotta go say goodbye. Okay, we need a car. Right. Like a pony, too. You know, I always wanted a pony. You take it out. Help me. What, we're gonna drive a bush? A bush with wheels there, smartass. Not oh, great. Next you're gonna tell me that you got the keys, right? Actually, I do. I'll hold this. You know, Dana's a lot nicer than you are. Yeah, well, she's also a smartass in her own way. Ladies first. Get in the back. My people, my sheeple, we've come to the end. This is the final frontier. You've given me the opportunity to voice out all my lunacy. And I am grateful, Capesinos. Even a prophet needs a crowd to wire him up and make him loud. So wherever you are, my lonely ones, my only ones, I hope your journey wrapped up tight into that good and final night. The moon's pouring down, and we gotta blow down. So good luck, and Godspeed, young Glenn. Mom! Mom! Karen! Mom, wait! Karen! What the hell? There's only two hours left. I know, I gotta go find the kids. But we need you here. I understand. Give me an hour. If I don't find them, I'll come back. Fair? Fair, fair. You have to stay here and figure out how to survive this. Have I ever lied to you? No, not even when I wanted you to. I'll see you soon. Bring them back. I oh, will. No. Be careful. Come on. This is the last of it from the motorhome. Great. This is what I call an art installation. Well, uh, if you want, but this is the best shot we got. Actually, our best shot would be a shuttle to Mars. Listen, you know what I'm thinking? Right in the middle of all this. The one is many, but the many are one. Yeah? All right. Why is that in the middle? Because everything leads to it. But why? But you know why. No, man, I don't. I have no clue, man. That's why I need you. I just, this just came into my head, flashed in my head, and I couldn't get it out. Same here. I mean, I know it's the key to the whole thing and everything, and I knew there was someone out there who was going to help me figure it out. When you said that I was an adept on the radio, I just understood that I was one. Yeah, which proves that it is you. You're an adept. What is it? Why? What, what is an adept? 
Well, to people like us, when we know something, man, we just know it, right? Like the physics of it all and everything like that. I mean, are you hip to the trip of what is causing all this? What's I guess gravity waves. Well, there you go. Lady wins a little bear. Yes. This whole region of space is getting hit by gravity waves, ripples in space and time. Well, how did you know? Mm. I have no clue. But usually when I say something, it turns out to be right. Like Mount Rainier. There you go. Right? See on this whole side of the board. This is the faith and myth side. We have things, skinwalkers, quests of quaddles, end time prophecies coming true. Yeah, yeah. Sure, but my thing is hard science. That's the other side. Which science. is why I need you, man. You see, you swing that shit, man. I can't. Yeah, well, here's what I'm thinking. The thing that's causing this, whatever it is, we have to try to understand that it has both a physical side and a spiritual side. But the, there has to be some kind of unifying principle that, that connects this with, you know, this and this and this. And Gloria and this. Douglas. Hi, right? Gloria Douglas. This is a professor I knew, Gloria Douglas. She was able to predict a lot of this. You know what she said? She said it just came to her. Yeah. Another addict. Right, but she said it was all about waves. Waves. She wasn't a physicist, so she didn't understand what kind of wave or why, but. She single? No, dead. <laughs> Dad, what about her computer cards? Right. Yeah, we have them in the, in the motorhome. Let's go. Yeah. I got these from her, but we have nothing to read them on. Here. Okay. Oh, are you kidding me, man? These are brilliant. But who knows what kind of machine it could take to read them? A Documation M200, last made in 1979. Oh, well, that's not good. Oh, don't harsh the buzz. I happen to own one. That's impossible. I bought it off a guy in 1981. I don't know why, but I kept it ever since. You know, all 222 pounds of it. Okay, well, let's, let's go run the cards. Oh, no. Yeah, a little problem there. My compadre's holding it for me. And he's got half my shit. Is he nearby? No, he's a few miles down the track. You know, I can get on the blower. What, the phone? Phones don't work, right? CB radio is some of the community have. Battery operated, so they uh, they still go. Hey, you know what? Also last made in 1979, same as your card reader. All right, let's go. Let's do it. Let's mash up the motor and see if we can scare up the mud duck. What, I, I don't actually mean? know, but I suspect it's relevant because. Okay. Okay. Hours. No, I'm not doing that. Just do it, for God's sake. Why? Why would I pull over? Because I need to pee. What do you mean you have to pee? That's not something with an unclear meaning. It'll take 20 seconds. Okay, well, I've shared a bathroom with you and I've seen you take 20 minutes. Plus, we could die any second. We're not gonna die this second. Okay, just pull over. Oh my God, God damn it, Matt. Right there. Okay, okay. Just pull over. Okay. Okay, great. Go, 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 and stop. Hurry up. I'm not waiting for you. I'll leave you behind. Look away! I'm not watching you, God! It's gonna go a lot faster if I know you're not looking. Okay! Hey! Yeah, so I, uh, I got good news, I got bad news. I'll take the good news. Well, my buddy's got a guy called the Junk Man. I'm guessing he's also the bad news? Well, here's the thing. Junk Man and I were solid. He's a league in old-time electronics. Uh, helped me build my studio. Kind of this really Bob, sweet... Bob, what's the bad news? Oh, the bad news. Yeah, uh, yeah, he says he's gonna kill you. So, why does the Junk Man want to kill my father? Because oh, the Skinny Jordan is dead. What? Well, that guy you met here, he's killed by the federal no, 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 I, I know, Skinny Jordan is... Well, the Junk no, Man why, why says it? that Skinny would still be alive if he hadn't met you, so he's That's holding ridiculous. you responsible. Well, you gotta... You gotta admit you're in the chain. Well, will he let you do the cards? No, 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 no. He said he'd kill me, too, because I'd be working for you. You coming? Uh, to meet the man who wants to kill my father. Yeah. Hour 50 left. Nothing better to do. Mm. All right, junk man. Here we come. Are you down? Or 
from holes and any of the other bullshit ways to die. waves are responsible for all this physical stuff. Well, they ring the earth like a bell, baby. That accounts for earthquakes, tidal waves, volcanoes. Is there any chance that the waves affect time, too? Oh, sure. They push and pull it all around. So, I'm not a physicist, but I believe that many in your community are beginning to accept the possibility, at least, of a multi-dimensional universe. Oh, that's an old and goldie. String theory says 11 dimensions. So, the gravity waves could also be breaking down the barriers between the 11 dimensions. That's exactly what they do. They compress them. They force them into one another. That would explain why we're seeing these these ancient demon gods. They're real. They're just not real in our home dimension. Right. Till now. So, all this stuff, the meteors, skinwalkers, they're just all different aspects of one truth. The one is many, but, but the, the many, many are, are one. one. Brother man. This is incredible. <laughs> Except we all die in, in what, an no. hour 40? Well, the answer is in this box. engine no you want some coffee look i was told to come here my engine stalled you think that's a coincidence think what you like i don't have time i have to find three kids two girls late teens one red one blonde a boy a little bit older sorry i'm out of time this is urgent everything's urgent today Got a key. Yeah. I was already told that today. It fits in the old ballast. The navel to the world. Our attachment to creation. Good to know. It will cast away shadows and bring light. Will it help me find my kids? Tells you anything you need to know the most. Like where they are. Whatever you need. Okay. Where is it? Right there. I had to go with her. It was my fault. I just freaked. I killed my friend a few days ago, and when I had to kill those people today, it was just too much. So we ran off. You, you, you took off from where? You were driving with me. No, I wasn't. He's been with me the whole time. We were running away, but Matt should be with you and your family. So you were never with me at all? No. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Nothing. I know nothing. How about you? Do you have a car? Yeah, uh, just, just up the road. Great. You drive. Well, um... 
It's either that or we all die out here. Lead the way. Nothing like mass extinction to kickstart a party. You call this a party? Well, I grant you, they could use a rhythm section. Do you see the junk man there? Brother man, you never see him until you don't want to. Documation M200. What a beauty. Say, there's an outlet right there. You see it? Yeah. Go plug that in there. Here we go. Okay. Anybody back there? Where I heard something. Power. Oh, yeah, the junk man always got the juice Hoover Dam quality out of his rig. I ain't nothing if not explicit. Oh, jeez. And I explicitly mentioned death in connection to you bastards. Now, didn't I? What are you doing to junk stuff? Whoa, whoa, we're just trying to keep us all alive. Are you the son of bitch that killed Skinny? No, I didn't kill Skinny. I like Skinny. Not as much as I did. And he liked me back. Jay, man, come on, my man, nobody likes you. Shut up. Shut up. Listen, he was murdered by a fed. I was there, I saw if it. If he hadn't have met you, he'd still be alive. What? In a, in a couple hours, we're all gonna be dead if you don't let us just run these cards. I got nothing to lose, do I? Oh, what? right now! Oh, that's, that's ridiculous, man. You have a gun? Yeah, if things don't change now, when would they? Yeah, she's a killer and a deep thinker. I didn't kill him, I shot him in the glutes. Yeah, because? Incapacitating, but not fatal. Also, easy target. Did you run the cards? <laughs> Here we go. So maybe each one of us is the universe. <laughs> a little god, you know? But not like a religious god. A god is in yourself. So you're a god. Why not? save the world. For instance, now would be good. I have appointments next week. Matt? Matt? What? Why are you talking like this anyway? I don't know if you're being funny or freaking me out. Don't freak out. We'll be fine. Just fine. Come on. I'll tell your fortune. It'll be fun. You have the key. What is that smell? Oleander and rotting flesh. Oleander's poisonous. Not fatally. Put your key in the slot. I don't know if I want to do this. What is this thing? It's not a regular game, is it? It won't change you. You'll just know something you don't know now. What if I don't want to know it? Tells you what you need, not what you want. Maybe it helps you find your kids. Try your luck.
You are the price for what you want. Okay, here we go. About to hear the last of Gloria Douglas's thoughts. How long does this garbage scow take to print something? It's primitive technology. It's... I don't think it even counts as technology. Oh, yes, and Gittins, here we go. The end of the world is not... What? No, not, it's not what? The end of the world is not... So it's just printing out the same thing over and over? Oh, I was way able to save a few of her cards. It must not have enough input. So after all this, it can't help us. Yeah, that seems to be the case here. What's that supposed to mean? Get out of the car. Okay, you're cracking up. Let's go talk about it. Not you. Stay in the car. Forget it. It's not a choice. Stay in the car if you want to live. Not without him. Look, Bree, you're right. This is very hard for you. I get that. You've had your older brother looking over you all your life. You never had to share me with anyone except maybe Dana. But you always ran over her. Now you have to share me with somebody else? That can't be easy. Especially for you. You always have to be the center of attention. No, I don't. This is the woman I fell in love with. She's part of the family now. I'll still always be there for you. But I'm with her, too. She's amazing, by the way. But you just don't know her yet. Uh, she's gonna change our family. She's gonna make it better. I promise. Give me the gun. You're not mad. You're a shifter, but you're smarter. What's a shifter? This is not a good time for Brianna drama. What are you doing? Back off, Sarah! It's cool, sweetie. It's not cool. He's dangerous. He'll kill you. Well, that is the worst shit that I've ever heard. Put down the gun! He's not my brother! I know my brother! Matt! Oh. Uh. Matt, uh. uh. what are you doing? How could you think this was me? What do you mean? It was your girlfriend! Oh. <sighs> we can't find our way home, so we're evolving. Soon you won't be able to kill us. Good thing you're in the world today, then, huh? Any day that you can shoot a huge, malevolent man in the ass and not answer for it, that day cannot be called a total waste.
You took off. Where did you go? I found Sarah. You didn't find me. I was miles away. Yeah, but it looked exactly like you. What the hell was that? Shapeshifter. <sighs> They've evolved. They're like a virus that copies your DNA and it starts killing people. And you found one that looked like me. What did you do with it? No choice. I killed it. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Trust me when I say you're relieved. Can you please explain to me what happened, Matt? I found Sarah. I wanted to grab a couple minutes with her. Okay, so to, uh, to clarify, the world's ending today, and you decided to stop for sex. I didn't do anything. I knew what she was, and by that point, you were already gone. Okay, and where did the truck come from? I hot-wired it. Of course you did. I learned from you. Can we please just get back to Mom and Dad? Huh? All right, but we're taking my car. It's cooler. So you made out with another woman? It's an exact genetic copy of you. How'd you know it wasn't me? <sighs> the kissing was weird. What about your shifter? The kissing was great. No, it wasn't. Way better than usual. Oh, shut <laughs> up. I like her. Great. of the world is not the end of the world is not what no, we know what it says peaches wait wait read it again it's, it says the end of the world is not the end of the world is not that's it it's fragmented the end of the world is not the end of the world the end of the world's not the end of the no, world when those uh, chunks hit it'll be the end of the world no it's not it never is in every end time story the end of the world is not the end of the world in Buddhism, cosmic law is restored. People live for 80,000 years. In Christianity, during the Christian apocalypse, heaven comes down to earth, and a new Jerusalem is born. It's never the end. I'm telling you, there always appears after the present something that's even better. Yeah. I'm not the religious type. Mostly metaphysics, but... Uh... It's based on the punch cards Gloria Douglas gave us. It's science. So it's telling us it's survivable. We just have to figure out how. Adept. So the sentence fragment is always in three pieces. Three, three, three waves. Three, three dimensions. Three ages. Dimensions. Yeah, Trinity. Three waves. Yeah, you mean the gravity waves. This thing comes in waves. So. so then this is telling us that there's three of them. Right, and the final event is the end of the first wave. This can be survived. Yeah. This can be survived. Yeah. How? Well, it doesn't tell us how. Yeah. Oh, we got less than an hour, loyalists. Way less. So the key is to get at that boundary between that physical and the spiritual thing. It's just like the yin and the yang, two sides that are coming together, equal but opposite, and then like dimensions colliding. That's where the mythical creatures are coming yeah, from. Yeah, we know there's contact points between dimensions everywhere. The wormholes. You mean a tiny black hole kind of wormhole? Yes. Like the kind that sucked up all the people in Seattle and dozens of other cities. Millions of people. Being pulled into other dimensions. Yeah, man, I get that. Sure, there could be storms of those things streaking through space like... Cosmic bullets. 
That's what that is. Exactly, man. That's exactly what it is. You are an addict. How's that gonna help us stop the moon rocks? I mean, in what? 44 minutes 44 left. minutes. 42 on a lucky first strike. Hey, 42, Jackie Robinson, baby. I love that, brother. They can suck up people. Can they suck up anything? Anything with space and time, my brother. Like big pieces of the moon. Right, how do we get the wormholes here? That skinwalker that was in you? Mm -hmm. Wait, what? The Tesla Tower drew it out, didn't it? Yeah, like it was magnetically attracted or, or something. Well, you know, Tesla figured out how to get the power from the atmosphere. That tower attracts electromagnetic energy of all kinds. And the wormholes pump energy like crazy. We have to turn it on. We have to leave it on. And they'll get pulled here. Assuming we can find a wormhole. If we got one in range. All right, so we drag a wormhole over the tower. It sucks the moon shit into another dimension. And right. nobody dies. If the wormhole gets here before the rocks. Right, which are on their way at 10 miles a second. Moondog, how's it coming with the line boosters? I want it done, brother, but you got company. Car coming in from out of the woods. It's mom. She found them. You made it. Yeah. I told you I would. We're using the Tesla tower to attract the wormholes. What? It's gonna take a whole hell of a lot of power, but I'm just gonna have to crank it to the max. Hey, uh, I wired up two line boosters in parallel. You think it'll work? Oh, yeah. Or the whole building will blow up, so, you know, 50-50. Welcome back. How was Delphi? Interesting. It always is. <laughs> yeah. Guys, look. Oh, God. Uh, what is that? Well, the tower's come back online. Let's hope the circuit can take the surge. It looks OK so far. Show me something. Either this brings the wormholes or it's over. It's okay, it's okay, Mom, it's working. It's working. Oh, what is that? That's the music of the spirit, baby. Bubble universe is popping out like cheap champagne, man. Holy shit. I think it's working. Yeah, baby. Come on. Come to. We're losing it. Stopping. Transformers pop. Circuit's broken. They're stalled. It's worse. They're disappearing. We're dead without them. The tower is fried. I'm the price for what I bought. Mom? What? Someone's gotta go close. That's all right. Karen. Wait, Karen. Mom? Karen! Wait! Can't go in there. It's unstable. Stay with the kids. Mom! Not again. Mom! Rihanna! Rihanna! Damn it! Dad, wait! Dad! God damn! It's locked! Door's locked! Here! Get that bar right there!
coming back, Mizon Farm. They're coming back, baby. Will the gravity be strong enough to pull in the debris? Let's hope so. Come on. Do it. Do it, baby. You got this. It's working. It's working. Holy shit, it works. Great googly moogly. Getting this. She's gone. You guys found me. We'll find Mom. 